So how are we all doing everyone? Welcome to a new episode on the channel. We are here at sunny Silverstone, as per, for the BRSEC's inaugural Driven By Racing event. Let's see what this is all about, shall we? In the C1 pit. Look at this. You might recognise that place. But yeah, so the guys have just gone out on track now. Uh, I'm going to just help myself to some more sweets. I love these events, it's great. And uh, just around here, we may have bumped into a familiar face. Hello, Robert. Uh, don't lick me, you dirty bastard. I was you, on the cheek. you dirty bugger. He's a tart, isn't he? Um, so yeah, so the next session of cars is going out now. We've got some BMW compact cars coming out. C1s have just gone out, just seen the. Uh, a couple of the uh, classics have gone out too, so yeah, so far so good. And as you can probably see from the footage, we've only done about 10 garages so far. There's still all of that to do as well. So we'll head on down there once we stop chin wagging with everybody. Right, rule 101 of the racetrack. Never ever go to a racetrack without your race gear. So fingers crossed, I'll be going out in a Clio Cup car in a minute. So uh, yeah, hopefully we'll get some uh, footage of that. So Fiesta Juniors. So our budding future stars. Oh yeah, that is, uh, that's very pretty. The future of race stars get to drive these. Very early age, it's scary the, uh, scary the age that these kids can drive these cars and how quick they can drive these cars as well. So it's, uh, <coughs> it's pretty cool to watch. Done a full lap of the pits now. I'll say there's loads of different series and championships here. Um, lunch breaks just finished as well, which is great. Uh, so the cars are going back out on track now. Um, we have got all the passenger laps and driver bands known to man. So we are uh, going to go see what we can blag racing wise, get some passenger laps. Chris from PBS said he'd uh, take us out in one of the uh, BMWs, so that'd be cool. And then I spoke to Jay at Finsport as well, who's going to take us out in one of the Clear Cup cars. So let's get a helmet on. And let's get out on track. Do you know what? I've seen these Gen 3s for years. Obviously, huge support of the BTCC back in the day. Here's the man here. Here he is. So these guys are just going to get it warmed up, get it ready to go. I'm going to bang the helmet on, and I'm going to get out on track. So we're going to get the GoPro in the car, so we can see me screaming like a little girl. How's that?
Gem 3 Clio, that was absolutely fantastic. Massive, massive thank you, sir. That was great fun. Thank you very much for that. You're welcome, That was mate. brilliant. Yeah, it's lovely bit of kit. Yeah, oh, I love that. It's brilliant. Yeah, so I what made you buy one? Um, I had to go in his. Uh, he made me drive one fault, a, ra it? a racing license. Oh, brilliant. So, then I had to, had to go and I had to have one. It's, yeah, I know. It's awesome. It's it. a wicked bit of kit. Like I said, I could not get over the, the gear changes on it were absolutely seamless. I think the noise as well. So good, isn't it? So, so much fun. fun. Yeah, that's what a race car should be, though. That is, that is the noise, the exhilaration, the smell. Perfect. No, thank you. Thank you very, very much You're for that. You're welcome. And, uh, oh, yeah, that's a great idea. I might go see if I can steal one of those. But yes, fantastic. Thanks, buddy. Right then, everybody. So I have just been brought into the Mini 7 Club garage because apparently someone has sorted us out passenger lab now she hasn't been telling me all day as what it's going to be in please tell me it's a mini please <laughs> i can't tell you oh i really hope it is because these things are wicked cool i'd love to have a go at one let's find out shall we so here we are i've been told to get to a garage at two o'clock because i'll uh, be getting taken out in a car turns out i'm going out in this how cool is this excited about this one.
<laughs> oh, that was so much fun. <laughs> that is brilliant. Oh, Mikey, that's brilliant. That is so much fun. Can I buy one now? <laughs> I'd love one of those. That's all you want to add, don't worry. Oh. Ridiculous. <laughs> so good. So good. Right then, so I've just had a go out in this absolute mad bit of kit here. Um, proper, how a race car should be, raw, sounds incredible, proper H-pan box, fantastic, so good. So, it's a shame it got red flag, really, not, not through any fault of our own, but that is, that is honestly, guys, if you want to get in, in with these minis, so you may have seen them on the touring car package, it's fantastic racing when you've got like 30, 40 of these all battling out with each other. Um, yeah, absolutely brilliant. Brilliant little cars, and I'm six foot five and I fit in one. So if you guys want to know any more about them, check out the Mini Seven Racing Club because that was good fun. So here we are in the Rab Sport Racing Garage, joined by Gary here, and you're going to take us out in this, aren't you? Certainly am. You are. So fresh, fresh from a race of remembrance win as well. We should add. But yeah, so um, I think what you got a guy in a minute. Having a taking someone out in a minute. Yeah, and then afterwards, um, we're, we're gonna he's going to try and uh, scare scare the crap out of me. So uh, let's see how it goes, shall we? <laughs> right, how are we doing then, guys? So we're over here right now, where the guys, the rescue teams, have actually they've just finished doing some rescuing, of cutting up cars, and figuring out how to rescue people whilst out on track. A huge shout out to Silver Lake for supplying the cars for this event. Um, yeah, unfortunately, due to the weather, they're uh, they're uh, going to be finishing up for the day. But we'll just go see this last one over here now. Just missed out on it, unfortunately. We were hoping to get it all on footage, guys. But uh, I hear you guys have just finished up for the day. Yeah, sorry. Yeah, that's all right. No, yeah, so we just finished. Sorry about that's, that. That's just that just shows how efficient you guys are. <laughs> yeah, we're, we're, that's what we like to think. So yeah, it's been a really, really good exercise. Yeah. Um, yeah, we had the opportunity to to work on some of these cars. Um, and just practice some of our skills. Yeah, so, brilliant. Yeah, we, we, did, we did a proper job of this one, which is great. Yeah, but, um, it's good to yeah, see a trusty cool. old Vectra being used still. It's, it's, it's the best thing that's had in its life, isn't it, really? Oh, don't say that. We own one. We've got, oh, we've, we've so got a sorry. race car version. Not, not the C, we've got the old B, but yeah, look at that. But it's good to know that we're in safe hands with these guys, or obviously any incidents out on track, these guys can come out here, get you out quickly, safely, because at the end of the day, a tin can can be replaced. You know, you necessarily so remember guys, if you need any parts for your race car, because it's off season right now, head over to silverlake.co.uk or you can call them. Plenty of stock in. It literally flies in through their yard. You've seen previous videos of ours. Um, but yeah, get in there quick, you'll be surprised what's in there. Give them a shout. We're off out on track, this guy's about to scare the shit out of me. Woo! <laughs> Look at this new four door city car cup ready for the 25th season 2020 2025 that seems like a mile away but it's really not it's, uh, Obviously 2023 now, but that's a great looking bit of kit. Built by SW Merch Sports. You obviously know a thing or two about building race cars. But yeah, exciting times. Club Merch Sport is absolutely booming. And look who we've just happened to bump into. What have you done? Uh, I've got a bad elbow. You got a bad elbow. <laughs> what have you done, you Wally? Um, ligament at the back of the knee. Oh, it's working too hard, that yeah. is. Oh, yeah. Well, it's carrying all that. Well, it's, 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 it's carrying this lot, is yeah, it? Yeah, it is, mate. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I know what it's like, man. I have to carry Steph around. It's, it's hard work. It's hard work. <laughs> and just like that, it's night time. Um, yeah, uh, we are now back at the car. The show is done and everyone's packing up and heading home. I uh, just want to say a massive shout out to BRSEC for uh, putting on this event. It was actually really, really good. First first event. Um, yeah, great networking tool. We've, we've not stopped talking all day with people. Uh, lots of new 
Got lots of new relationships started up, some good conversations to uh, to be had leading on from this, and this is why this event is so good. So, uh, yeah, really good. Great to catch up with some old friends as well. And as you see, everyone is uh, now heading home. So I'm going to sign off. If you've enjoyed this video, remember to hit that like and subscribe button. We'll see you guys in the next video.